I got a new camera. I got a new camera. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Max Smith and I live in a van, which is apparently my whole personality. Today I am going to be showing you guys how I survived the tripod. I just wanted to talk about my winter bed slash camping setup and basically how I got through this winter in Malibu, which is my first winter in the van. There were many 30 degree nights. There were some 20 degree nights. I had a 12 degree night in Big Bear. Yeah, so I'm just gonna jump right in. So this is my bed. Uh, you can see here, I've got this rolled up towel. Uh, that's to support my neck because I went to the chiropractor and they said I have like the straightest neck that they've ever seen, so. That's awesome. Uh, I've got a satin pillowcase because my hair is fragile, but uh, it gets really cold at night. I'm going to move the jackets out of the way. Uh, so we're going to start digging in some layers here. So the first thing on top is my Target Sherpa blanket. I bought it before I bought the heated blanket. I thought it would protect me, but it didn't. Uh, below the Sherpa blanket, I've got my light, like, summer comforter. I think it's from Ikea, and it's really nice and light. And then below that is the Peace de Resistance. That is my heated blanket. That is literally the only reason I survived this winter. It's amazing. It's incredible. It keeps me toasty in here. And basically, I just plug it into my inverter, which is across the van. Sorry for the mess over there and yeah that's how I survived in this bed the number one thing that I can recommend is the heated blanket I used this thing every single night um, for the last two months I really liked my setup a lot of people get the mr. buddy is that what they're called mr. something heaters they freak me out because they run off actual fuel instead of just electricity. So I would worry about like carbon monoxide poisoning. And I just didn't really want to contribute more to my fossil fuel footprint than I already am. I have a pure sign inverter, which is the more expensive kind of inverter, but it's better power. Like it's safer to use with an electric blanket because I swear to God, these things catch fire. Like I won't be surprised if they're um, like illegal to produce in a couple years. So, pros and cons. That's how I survived the winter with pure sign inverter and a heated blanket. The only thing is I wish I had something to keep my head warm. I would wake up in the middle of the night pretty frequently cold and have to like tuck myself into my blanket. Oh, Kira's calling me. Oh my God, hi. Hello. Hi. How's going? Good. How are you? Yeah. Got a host time, my shorty. That's literally me and Kira. In other news, I started my Patreon, so you can go on there and see what tiers are available. If you want to talk to me one-on-one, -on -one, there's an option for that. If you want me to literally roast you, there's a tier for that, so... I'm gonna have to do a updated van tour here soon because... As you can see, I've added some decor to this little house of mine. As always, thank you. Have a great day. Um, yeah, love you.